Mad Dog, this is a question. Mm -hmm. uh, do you feel like Otani or Judge is more entertaining? Well, I think the negative with Otani is he's on the West Coast and the team stinks. All right? I mean, it's the Angels. They overshot and the team's terrible. The 14-game losing streak. So, and the Yankees are the Yankees. Yankee Stadium. He's batting two in the lineup. They're 56 and 20. There's an element of that. But as far as what he does on a day-in, day-out basis, and I'm not a huge Otani groupie, okay. as everybody is. But listen, he hits, what, what do you have, eight RBIs, two three-run homers? Two home runs and, and eight RBIs. And the next day, he had 13 strikeouts. Mm -hmm. What did he do right. last night? He had, what, 11 strikeouts, yeah, 12, 12 strikeouts? Yeah, yeah, he's filthy. And, he hit, and then he hits. So, you ha to be fair, Judge only gets four bats a game. Otani, when he pitches and he hits... You right. get a, you get a whole deal with them. That makes sense, Courtney. Mm -hmm. I think Judge is the more exciting player because of everything that we're so locked in on watching him doing right now. Remember, this is somebody who bet on himself and turned on two hundred million dollars this past off season. And when he talks about, you know, I'm the best player on this team, I should be confident. I love that. I love somebody who knows their worth and knows what they're bringing to this team right now. He's got 29 home runs. His war is like the fourth best in, in Major League Baseball. All he does for this team is excel. They can move him from right field to center field. They can move him from the two spot to hitting leadoff. And there's a reason that this team is as good as they are right now. What, 56 and 20, 13 games ahead of the Red Sox? I don't. I know that's a really tough division. I, you know, I, I live with a with a Tampa Bay Rays fan, so it's very difficult for me to hear about this on night in and night out basis. So I get it, but he's just the marketability factor of someone like Aaron Judge. We're watching him not only trying to chase that big time contract that he's gonna get, whether it's from the New York Yankees oh, or whether it's from a team like the Dodgers next year. We're also watching him chase 61. I hope he gets it. I hope they give him the opportunity to get it because. Like we've talked about, we like records in baseball. For whatever reason, the modern era, the modern fan, baseball itself doesn't seem to you know, be all that concerned about it. I like seeing records chased in baseball. I like seeing somebody have a goal that they're going for. So continue to let him go for it at this rate. Yeah, to me, it's Otani. I hate to go against you because you made some valid points by Aaron Judge, but this is where we are Major League Baseball, that the biggest organization ever in the history of sports is the New York Yankees. You can wear a Yankee cap anywhere in this world and people know exactly what that organization is. You got a guy that is in the biggest market in the world and Aaron Judge doing this and we're having a conversation who's a better, better show because that just used to never be a conversation. If a Yankee was doing this, yeah, he was the show. He was. That was it. But that shows you where Shohei Otani is, that we know his team's not going to be any good. And you talk about the money that Aaron Judge is going to get. What kind of money is Shohei Otani going to get when he becomes a free agent in 2023? I guarantee he's going to get more than Aaron Judge because of what he's able to do as a pitcher and as a hitter. And he is must-see TV. People search out his highlights where he had the second most viewed highlights on YouTube of any athlete not named Steph Curry in the last three months. And his team is awful. His team's not going anywhere. But when he does his thing, people want to see him do that. He is a video game player in front of us each and every night, no matter what the Los Angeles Angels are doing. So for my money, he is the show in terms of what he does. He's better of, a better watch than Aaron Judge. And I love the long ball. I'm not a chick, but I love the long ball from Aaron Rodgers. But Aaron Judge does what he does. But with Shohei Itani, when he's at the plate or in the pitcher's mound, I can't take my eyes off him. He is the show, Lord and Aaron Jones. Courtney's right, though, on one point, because when they get to August and the Angels, we've forgotten about Otani and they're 30 games under 500 and they're on their way for that. That's fair. And then Judge has got 44, yes. 45 home runs, and the Yankees are having this historic year. Mm -hmm. I mean, remember, the Yankees at 56 and 20. Do you know that's the third best record after 76 games in the history, since 1930? Which is saying something for an organization 1930, like that. 1930, Seattle and the 98 Yankees. Mm -hmm. So if they're doing that and he's got 45 home runs and it's August 15th, and, you know, we're, the baseball fans are going to pay attention to what they're going to look at. They're going to look at Judge trying to get to 61. Yeah. And think about this, too. I mean, what he does for the rest of the team, how, how, how his success translates to success elsewhere. So if Giancarlo Stanton hits his 20th home run today, Rizzo already has 20. Aaron Judge already has 20. They'll be the seventh trio in Major League Baseball history to mm. hit that mark. Good one. Yeah. That's, that, to me, draws more eyeballs on right. your product. The sure. one thing with Aaron Judge that I'm – Still holding out hope for here because I know he leads the league uh, in, in voting for the, for the All-Star game. I really want to see him hit home runs in Dodger Stadium. How, how great would that be? I mean, you're, you're a New Yorker. The oh, foreshadowing that that could potentially have on him next season. 
well, hitting I, home runs in the stadium where he might be playing. I, I just don't know if the Dodgers have all that money. They right. get pets for in 30 I mean, how much do they have? Somehow they yeah. continue to find it. Yeah, they, they do. Work. They do. Yeah, but here's that may be too most, much. Here's the most important thing, and this is involved for our, for our network. I hope he, he's not going to participate in that home run derby. Hope something can change his and, and that And that, to me, I don't yeah. understand It's that. like LeBron not being in a slam dunk competition, when, to be honest with you. Yeah, but, but how is Judge, I mean, and Trout's got to be in there, too. That's a big night for baseball. Mm -hmm. It's a Monday night before the All-Star game that gets a great rating. Right. And, he, and Judge is going to pass... At yeah. Dodger Stadium, I know. with yeah. that great background and those pavilions, so oh, being, oh, come yeah. on, participate. We know that baseball has a marketability problem. I get that. I don't know if I'd be able to walk into a restaurant and see Mike Trout and be like, "That's Mike Trout." I'd be right. I would do be able to do that for Aaron Judge because we see him on TV all the time. He's on this network all the time internationally. I think that people would be able to agree with me on that in being able to pick him out and be like, "That's that's Major League Baseball right now." So he's the face of the sport. He's the face right. of the sport, and it is a bummer. I really hope that something can change his mind and get <laughs> him to that home run derby. Think, think, yeah, about, think about how Shohei's you know, public persona in the stock rose after what he and did he last did year. Yeah. The perfect inning he had at the All-Star game. Right. And then going, going yard 28 times, yeah. I believe, in the home run mm -hmm. derby. He did credit. He did both. He yes. did both. Yeah, he did mm -hmm. both. And, and I get it. If you're chasing a record like 61, maybe, maybe that's something that would just less wear and tear than one little break you'd get there. But I still want to see him do it. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.